Well, the weather has been so comfortable the last few days, but all good things come to an end, Brian. Yeah, Denise, triple digits on the horizon for us. A really good reminder to keep an eye for heat dangers. Christian Costner is joining us live in studio. He's got some tips for medical experts to avoid a trip to the ER. That's right, Brian and Denise. Well, it may seem like common sense, but if you're a local or just visiting, you might want to pay close attention. Basic rule, rule number one, is to stay hydrated. Many people tend to forget that. That's what the team at the American Medical Response recommended. They stress the importance of drinking plenty of water, applying sunscreen, and wearing clothing that protects your arms and legs as well as your face. Now, the dangerous heat can cause a sunburn within minutes. Some signs to watch out for: dizziness, vomiting, or confusion. They say the summer. Summertime is their busiest time of the year with a 20% increase in heat related emergency calls. But the heat can also lead to other dangers that many people tend to ignore. People want to get into the pool. They want to, you know, cool off whatever they need to do. So we're going to also stress when it comes to water, uh, make sure you're aware of what's going on in the water, especially with our little ones. They're so excited to get into the pool. So we really do stress um, safety devices. And if you do have a pool at home, make sure those gates are locked. With pools always busy during the summer, Leslie Schaffer with the uh, AMR recommends taking a swim class. They never heard. It could really be a life or death decision in the future. And of course, always call 911 in case of an emergency. Also, as COVID restrictions roll back and more people head outside, it's a good reminder that alcohol does not count for hydrating yourself. AMR recommends a cup of water along with that drink that you get at the bar. Christian Casadas, 8 News Now. Kristen, thank you. So we asked on Twitter, if you're a local, does the heat bother you or by now are you just used to it? Here are the numbers. 31% said, yeah, I'm bothered by this heat. 69% say, well, they've gotten used to it.